Hey everybody, uh, I am Eric, and tonight we are going to play Noctis. Uh, so we're going to start at the top, tell you what it is, and tell you how to play it on modern computers. Um, so let's start at the top. Noctis is basically a space flight simulator uh, that was made in the year 2000, made by a guy from Italy named Alessandro Gignola. This is what he looks like right here. And basically the game is like um, you're in a spaceship, you're like a cat-like creature that has the ability to crawl on all four or walk up on two legs. And so this, this group of cat people um, called like the Felicians or something like that uh, basically sent like a group of people in these spaceships called like star cruisers all over this one galaxy to like explore or whatever. And then when they came back to try to like update their planet on what happened, everybody was gone. So that's basically what they had to like deal with. Their ship isn't like powerful enough, doesn't have enough warp to get out of the galaxy, so they're stuck there forever alone. So that's basically the game. You start off in space and you're in a ship and you literally can just start going to any planet that you want to. So there are two versions of the game right now that are current-ish, I guess you could say. The first one is uh, the official version of the site here on anynowhere.com. This is uh, Alessandro's uh, website, and it's got the download link right here. Uh, this is the official version by the publisher. However, there's another version, which is available on mooses.nl forward slash nice forward slash about. And this is uh, Noctis for the Community Edition. And basically, um, these guys asked the owner of the game, uh, the creator of the game, rather, if they could see his source code and fix it um, and improve upon it. And that's exactly what they did. Um, and so I decided to download this version. So you can go here and then go down to the bottom and click right here. And it will bring you to this page. And you can click on this zip file and download it and it's 4.8 megabytes, takes just a couple seconds. Click on it, <laughs> whenever it does finish. Uh, extract it to, um, I chose my C drive right here and I made a file in there called Noctis. So C for uh, forward slash Noctis. You can do this or you can put it anywhere that you want and then just click OK. Um, it's asking me if I want to overwrite it because I've already put it in there and I'm just going to click Cancel. Um, you obviously wouldn't do that. It would just appear in there for you. Um, so I'm sorry if uh, you, <laughs> if this is very elementary for you. Um, this is just for anybody that doesn't uh, know how to do this. Um, so you have the game, and then it won't work immediately on a new system. I actually have a, a Windows 8 laptop here, um, 8.1 actually, um, and it's uh, 64 uh, bits. So. To make this work, I had to go to DOSBox.com and download um, under the Downloads page here. Uh, I had to download the Windows version of this program. And even though it says Windows 32 installer, it works uh, for a 64-bit system. Uh, so basically install, download this um, by clicking here. It'll bring you to their SourceForge uh, page. And this is basically the exact same system that we did for... Um, the actual game itself. Download this, install the um, executable on your system. Doink. It is right here. I've already installed it. It will appear on your desktop. Um, oop, let me minimize that. It'll appear on your desktop uh, right here or wherever if you want it to, um, if you check that option. But you don't ever actually have to open it from here. Um, in order to get the game to play now, uh, you, that's, that's everything that you have to do in order for the game to work. So let's go uh, to our, um, you know, my computer area, open up our C drive, and then open up our Noctis folder. And what we're actually looking for is the file called dwnoctis.exe. Uh, by double-clicking that, um, it'll open up the game. So let's uh, click on that and um, play the game. 